Right now, a desperate need for mothers, fathers and all caregivers. In the past weeks, diaper prices have climbed between three and $15, and it's a spike that really hurts families who are already struggling to make ends meet. WCPO 9 News' Allie Kramer is live in Newport with what you can do today to find some cheap diapers and also help others in need. Good morning, Allie. Well, good morning, Adrian. You know this feeling as a parent yourself and uh, every parent or caregiver that has to change a child's diaper this morning. It was that feeling of reaching for a diaper and then realizing it's not there. Maybe you didn't restock. Maybe you really just can't afford to buy them. And that's the problem right now. More and more caregivers are finding themselves in this tight spot where they're out of diapers because they simply can't afford them. And in fact, this has been sort of uh, slowly creeping in during the pandemic, finally kind of hitting that breaking point for a lot of families right now. This I want you to see is the Sweet Cheap's diaper bank. This is their warehouse and what it should look like, a supply of about three months worth of diapers. But CEO Megan Fisher tells us at the height of the pandemic, her warehouse was wiped out. 53 partner agencies were serving 4,500 families. Fisher says they saw a lot of situational poverty. So it was people that were losing their jobs during the pandemic. And they actually had a 25% increase in diaper distribution during the height of the pandemic, but those requests were much higher than that. A recent report shows that one in three families ex is experiencing what's called diaper need. Fisher says that that has been the case for decades. Families are waking up in the morning going, I have three diapers. How am I going to get to my, my kid to daycare? You have to send your kid with a full day supply of diapers in order to drop them off at daycare. So it's really hard to know, do I get to go to work today? Do I get to go to school? When you wake up looking at two or three diapers left and knowing that has to get you to your next paycheck because you have to have cash to buy diapers. And Megan says that's a big misconception. Oftentimes people think that government assistance can help families out, but that's not the case. Government assistance and food stamps, things like that, only cover food and not basic necessities, necessities, things like diapers, which is why this drive is so important. So here's the deal. You can drop off new diapers, open packs of diapers. They will take anything at 42 area Starbucks locations. We're at the one here in uh, the Newport Fort Thomas neighborhood. They have a big blue bin right when you walk in. This one actually looks pretty full. So it's more promising than the one that we uh, went to out in Anderson just last week. So something to consider maybe when you're uh, swinging by to grab your coffee this morning, be thinking of others as well. Guys.